Hey there. Sorry about last week. Um, as I mentioned, I did get the second COVID shot on Thursday, Thursday, Tuesday afternoon. And it put me out of my ass for a couple of days. And uh, decided not to try making any videos. So sorry about that, but we're back for your very special Wednesday edition. Going back to basics. Why is that? Because I think I'm doing what I did the first ever GeoGuessr one because this is the last video I'll be doing. Uh, whether or not it's going to be like total, total, complete bleed, um, still it's left to be decided. But as it stands, it basically is. Um, I'm going to be pausing at least doing any of the baking stuff, GeoGuessr stuff. Indefinitely, at least, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's just figured I've done enough of these. It's not as enjoyable to do all the editing for it as it used to be. It was kind of a crunch to do these things when I'd find time for it. And when it would stop being fun and enjoyable is when I told myself, yeah, that's going to be it. So, yeah. Um, if I end up actually coming back, it might not be for a very long time, but it's essentially the end. So we're going to go out in a swan song, swan song of sorts doing GeoGuessr World one last time. And I guess it's going to not so much be talking about what I see. This is just more going to be the backdrop of just me talking. As they usually are, aren't they? But anyway, um, it's funny. I try to remember the exact time my friend and I actually started doing this because we talked forever actually making one of these things, a YouTube channel. Uh, the area code. Can I see one of those? No. And we talked about it for years, on and off, on and off. Mostly him. And I was like, yeah. I'll give it a shot. I watch enough of these things that how hard could it be? And so we started doing it and with many hobbies at least. Uh, so this is Tobin Lake. I don't know where that is, but I feel it's, it's got Northern Pike, so it's got to be at least in the, I'm going to say the Northeast U.S., maybe Canada. Um, we started with the gusto, we got all the stuff, we had no idea what we were doing. Just recording it in his office in this new house that he got at the time with his... Oh, it's Saskatchewan, huh? Uh, that is not where I thought it was going to be. Um, let's go down to Saskatchewan. Some lakes here. I'll just click that one. We at least got the province right, that's good enough for me. And we recorded... Um, Uncharted. It's, try to go back and listen to that now. It's hilarious and embarrassing listening to us talk and panicking about any quiet, like, silence on the mic. It, it, it's really no different when you hear about people when they first go back in a payphone, you say. Listen to their first videos. And they're like, oh, God, what, what, why are we panicking or anything like that? We do that for a while, and... With most things, at least, I feel maybe doing things with him, it was, oh yeah, this is awesome, and then doing it for a while, then eventually something else would pop up. And, you know, you gotta do this, gotta do this, gotta hold off on this. And we went from using, uh, what was the, um, Da Vinci? I think it was a free video, video editing software. Da Vinci something, I think. And it was great until it wasn't. And when it wasn't, oh boy, did it just refuse to work. And uh, we ended up screwing, like, not being able to get any. Oh, actually, I ended up getting the right lake. Look at that. It ended up uh, Poland. Well, I think we, well, maybe not. This could still be something French. Um, basically ended with me. Eventually taking over all the editing, 
because he he started doing it at the start because I think he had a little bit more knowledge of it than I did. And eventually when Da Vinci stopped working, or he didn't have time to do it because of other things, uh, I ended up taking over and uh, eventually ended up getting Adobe Premiere Pro, Pro, which I'm still using now. Avenue to France. I think, I don't think this is France though, oddly enough. I think this might be uh, Netherlands or Belgium type thing. Let's see if I can't, oh, well, we're not going to see it there. And slowly, <clears throat> it was uh, playing stuff with him, and then miss one, you have to pause, do something else, and then it just started from there with the slowly tailing off until we were doing one of the Uncharted's. And then he just kind of stopped for a while, then showed back up with a shadow of the Colossus. And I was like, oh, let's just do this for a bit. I was like, okay, we'll do this. Like we were in the middle of something else. But whatever. And did maybe, I don't remember how many of those. Two, three. Then it was over. And then it just kind of gave me. And I was like, okay, I guess I'm doing this now by myself. And it was, I think, a little after. Well, whatever the timeline is for the Shadow of Colossus, whenever that came out, I think it might have been like in the spring or something. Where the hell is this? Ile de France. Well, Ile de France is in Paris, I believe, isn't it? Or am I, am I, eh, it's the, the Isle of the City. No, nah, I'm just going to click here, although I, I'm, mm. May not be. The A4. A4 is one of these, isn't it? Yeah. But I'll say we're over here, although it's a different color A4, which has me a little worried. I don't see an A4 around here. I see an A3. Has me a little word. There's N4, A4. Well, shit, I guess we're going to go with Paris. Yeah, all right, that's fine. And it was me just taking over. Figure, okay, what do I want to do with this? GeoGuessr's fine. I enjoy this. Got to figure something that I guess you could say is the, the staple, the thing that I'll do the most frequent. And I did it for a while. And for a while it was... I don't 2017 might have been when I started that, like November or something. Did that uh, three times a week. Eventually, being like, all right, that, I got to do something. I see that said Sonoma, so this is oh, Sonora. So I think this is probably Arizona. But. Did that, eventually did a thing on Mondays. So I was like, hey, let's do something interesting with Mondays where I'll do the States. And I did that for, might have been 50 straight weeks. Then it was over, it was like, by the end, I was like, okay, I'm kind of, it's interesting as it is, I need, if I was going to do a Monday thing again, I got to figure something else out. And I was thinking of doing things like the same thing, only with countries, but then I would have, what, what, what are the countries in there? Am I going to find all the information? Am I going to have time to do it? Oh, it's Tucson. All right. Well, here we go. Just click here. Somewhere there. A. Aho. East AJO. I know I was going to have the time to do that and do some other stuff. Because this was all still stuff I would do when I'm not working. When I've got some spare time. And juggling all of that while still, why did it jump me over here? While still being interested in it. That's always the, uh, the main crux of everything. It's like, you still enjoy doing it, keep doing it until you can't. And then I started adding other stuff to it. The, um, what are they called? 
those little videos I did with the GoPro, those were fun. I still enjoy doing those, and when I was saying, like, temporarily, uh, at least for a long hiatus at the least, if I was to come back and do any more um, stuff, it would just be mainly probably around doing videos like that, where it was just mainly just some music in the background, and then all of the visuals kind of being tied to the song. Highway 10, East and West. So I think Kino Highway. Oh, that was Kino there, so we're like here. So we're maybe back there, maybe like in there. Um, but still having time to do that and everything else I do, that, that's part of where the hangout was coming. The cooking stuff was taking a bit more time. It felt, I'll get into that in a little bit in a sec. I gotta go uh, check my phone real quick, sorry. Yeah, I'm back. The uh, cooking stuff ended up being the next thing I did, mainly because it was around last year. After my aunt ended up dying, one of the things she ended up doing before my grandmother died is she made this um, book, as it's always in the beginning of the videos. She went through and selected a bunch of recipes that were in there to uh, share with everybody in the family. I always just thumbed through it. I really never did too much with it. I figured let's give this cooking thing a, chi uh, a, chai, a try. And I think I'm almost up to a year. That might be a little less. But I was never really satisfied the way the editing and that ended up being like the amount of time the 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 editing and all the effects that I wanted to do with it. I wasn't able to mainly because I'm just bad at the editing. The amount of time that I can commit to doing this and you know, I've been doing it for, in general, just basic editing of videos. These things. I've been doing it long enough that I feel like what I'm putting out and what is coming out is not... I mean, what I want to have come out and then what is the end result. It never really, like, connected. And I would always just be annoyed more than anything else. And I don't want to be annoyed with how the end result is. I'd like to enjoy it. It's just juggling around the, the time thing. And that's where it all stands. Everything is always just finding the time if you still enjoy doing something. Knowing when to stop and then potentially maybe when to come back. I mean, it, it's the second time I've at least gone on high as it could be more, but the previous one was the busted collarbone, which might be like Two years? No, I did it in 2018. Actually, I think it's coming up on the anniversary of that. So it's like maybe two years, 11 months since I did that. Where my one, one, of, ugh, my, one of my arms, that's what I was trying to say, I busted and had to be in a sling, so it was very hard to do any of the video stuff. So I decided to pause and then <laughs> just got distracted doing other things. And then somebody ended up messaging me saying like hey where'd you go where are the videos and I was like you know what why not we'll get back into it then I've just been going non-stop since then well the prior week and when I went on vacation in Iceland but I think I had videos all set and ready to go for those if I remember right I could be off but that's where it ends all right back sorry Final one. I'm not even going to bother searching around here, I think. Or maybe I just won't put a point down. But I'd like to thank everybody who's uh, decided to take time out of their day doing whatever it is they do. Taking the 16 to 20 to 25 minutes to be like, no. I think I'll watch this weird monotone guy from uh, 
Vermont attempt to do his own version of GeoGuessr for the better part of, I'm going to say four years. I think it might have been like November 2017 I started, but off and on, people have come and gone. I don't really understand how everybody got here. If it was some suggestion or something off of some other YouTube algorithm. <clears throat> Excuse me. But decided to stay and watch. It's uh, weird how it starts. And sticks, I should say. The uh, I don't know. There, the, it's it's wording of this. I mean, it's just always just like, wow, you sat here and watched this. The thing, I mean, I kind of talked about this maybe like two months ago of the people who decide to watch this stick with it. It's just weird, wild, I should say. Oh, a dead end. How this ended up being like, no, I'm going to decide to watch these whenever you get around to it or comment. You know, I might say something of ask a question about some place and someone very dutif dutifully, I should say, will leave a comment, fill me in on the information, and I try very much to uh, remember what they say. Uh, they tell me so if it comes around again I'll remember but brains are weird like that you try to remember stuff but it doesn't always stick but I think 2016 it might have been when we started it might have been later maybe earlier concept of time for the past 10 years has just been mush to me but it's been a good ride I'd like to thank everybody for their time taking it out to comment, to watch, to tell me what you think, give me tips, all of that stuff. It was very much appreciated. And over these past years, I like to think that, if nothing else, you enjoyed some of this stuff. Maybe I helped with Unwinding in the day, prepping you for the day, whatever it was. It's silly that the 20 or something minutes I take to do these and then edit and upload may have helped you in whatever way. Maybe you'll learn something, I don't know. But there we are. There you are. Thank you again. It's the wording trying to understand exactly what to say for the end of this is all just off the cuff, but above all else, thank you. I appreciate the amount of time that you guys have taken. <laughs> uh, if I go back and listen to what I'm saying here, I'll just be slapping myself in the face, calling myself an idiot. Ooh, just head-butted the uh, pop screen. Anyway, enough beating around the bush. Here we are. The end of a period. I guess it's an era. That's GeoGuessr. That's Bobby Fist. Oh, God. I haven't said the name of the channel in so long. Doesn't sound that great, but whatever. Thank you for your time. Go out. Enjoy your life. I'm going to try to. And. If this ever comes back, we'll be here. Thank you all. Take care. <laughs>